subscribe good afternoon good afternoon good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel my name is Dave Natch I speak stocks today is Sunday October the 31st it's Halloween last day of the month in today's video I have two plays for you to put on stock this coming week this is another episode of Sunday stock list and also, I'll run down the top five percentage gainers for the month. Let's jump right into it. Before I go there, let me delve into Friday's recap of the markets. The Dow closed up 0.25% on Friday, sitting at 35,819, the Dow. The NASDAQ, they closed up 0.33%, sitting at 15,492. Apple. Apple plunged 1.82% on Friday. They're currently sitting at $149.80 pennies. This is a buying opportunity. Anything under 150. Apple, I will be buying up on Monday. Let's hop right into the top five percentage gainers for the month of October. Sitting at number five, we had BGI, BGI, they closed up 139% for the month. They're currently sitting at $6.80. There's no news out. The last news they had was on September 30th. They've been going up under the radar. BGI, pay attention. 24 consecutive higher lows. 24 consecutive higher lows. And the stock made also 23 consecutive highs. Higher highs, that's one month of gains there. Slow and steady, BGI. Pay attention. Stock number four. At number four, we have HUDI. At number four, H -D -H -U -D -I, they're up 314% on the month. They're currently sitting at $17.29. HUDI. Sitting at number three, we have BKKT, BKKT closed the month out at 322%, 322%. They're currently sitting at $42.52. This one was Dave's play on October the 26th. Go ahead <laughs> for that. Go ahead to that video for the numbers. BKKT, it's not done, okay? The stock is breaking out, making new 52-week highs. BKKT sitting at number two, we have PHUN Fund. Fund closed out the month at 365 percent, 365 percent gain at four dollars and 29 cents. Currently sitting at 429. Okay, they're currently sitting at 429. This was Dave's play on October the 22nd. Okay, there's no bank. That's going to give you this kind of return. This kind of return. Beg your pardon. Please sit tight for number one. Do remember, if you wish to open a trading account, check out my Webull link below. You'll get some free stocks. Also, pre-market hours trading starts at 4 a.m. sharp. 4 a.m. sharp with Webull. Webull only the way to go. The number one percentage gainer for the month of October is DWAC, DWAC, DWAC is up 582% on the month. They're currently sitting at $67.75. This was Dave's play on October the 22nd when the stock spiked to $175. That's their 52-week high, $175. Dollars DWAC that they made over a thousand percent move. DWAC, please sit tight for two stocks to put on stock this coming week. Ah! <laughs> 
Please hammer like. Please subscribe to the channel. Around here we find supernova movers early. Dave's Play, the place to be. Stock number one to put and start this coming week. This one is a BP play. A bounce play. Okay? H-U-D-I. H-U-D-I closed the down. They closed down 39% on Friday. Sitting at $17.29 on no news. Let's get the tires. Let's see if this one could make a quick bounce back this week. And they're also down over 5% in the uh, after hours h-u-d-i pay attention they were a market cap of 179 million they have a low float of 3 million 76 percent of the float are held by insiders 0.23 percent of the float are held by institution and shorts has one percent of the float their profit margin is a positive two percent their operating margin is a positive 2.41 this is HUDI. Their ROA is a positive 1.19%. Their ROE is a positive 4%. Their revenue is 63 million. Bear with me with these boring numbers here. Their revenue per share is 6.03. Their quarterly revenue growth is up 17% year over year. This is HUDI. Their gross profit is 11 million. Their EBITDA, earnings before interest, taxes, depreciation, and amortization, is a positive 2.25 million. They have 20 million in total cash, 71 million in total debt, and their current ratio is sitting at 1.57 HUDI. Let's jump right into stock number two. This one has a nice chart going on, okay? Very nice chart. A-T-E-N, pay attention to this one, A-10, A-10 is up 35% on Friday at $18.69, the company came up with strong third quarter results, go ahead and read the results on your own time, your own term, the stock is breaking out of 52 week high, pay attention, this one is in the software space, let's kick the tires, A-10 wears a market cap of $1 billion. They have 58 million in the float. 5% of the float are held by insiders. 87% of the float are held by institution. I will repeat that. Institution has 87% of the float. This is A-T-E-N. Shorts has 3%, okay? Their profit margin is a positive 10%. Their operating margin is a positive 11%. Their ROA return on asset is a positive 6%. Their EBITDA, earnings before interest, taxes, depreciation, and amortization is 35 million. Their net income is 24 million. Okay. Uh, let me back up real quick. Their ROE, return on equity, is a positive 20%. They have 233 million in total revenues. Okay. Their gross profit is 175 million. Let me say that again. A10 has a gross profit of 175 million. Their quarterly earnings growth is up 74% year over year. Total cash is 107, 167 million. 167 million in total cash. And their total cash, their total debt is 26 million. 26 million, bringing them to a healthy current ratio of. 2.42, okay? A10, the stock to watch. Let's continue. Their operating cash flow is a positive 52 million. Their leverage free cash flow is a positive 37 million. A-T-E-N. That's all I have for you, ladies and gentlemen. Do not forget to follow me on Twitter for my stock alerts. In the meantime, always set a stop loss. Always protect your neck. We want to live to trade another day. When you see a profit, take some profit, okay? And I'll see you tomorrow with Dave's Play. Do not forget to set your notification for the video upload. Be safe, and I'll see you tomorrow with the plays. Dave Natch, I'm out. Boom, bam, make your next trade your best trade. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday.
space blank check company go ahead and do your research on those another big winner fun phun i tweeted this one out early congratulations to whomever pounced yesterday the stock closed up 46 percent at 153 the stock opened up at 105 spiked as high as 192 and the low on the day 103 the volume yesterday 106 million shares exchange hands and their average volume is 2.9 million phun but it's not done fun is up 300 percent in the pre find an opportunity please sit tight for dave's all right thank you for watching dave natch i'm out Let's get the tires. Twenty car strong. Looking good, smelling good.